Okay, we're now going to talk about how to get a command line interface on Windows or on a PC. Um, as I note over here, relatively few startups use Windows computers for their primary development, uh, mainly because command line support has been something of an afterthought. Uh, there is now, uh, you know, PowerShell and a few other things that are out there for Windows. But for the purpose of this class, uh, we recommend that you use Sigwin to get a Unix-like environment on your Windows computer. Uh, and the way you can do that is basically going through the following screens. Um, you go to sigwin.com uh, and uh, then um, you will uh, just get the setup.exe and double click it. Um, step through the, the following steps over here, direct connection, you know, choose mirrors.kernel.org for speed. Uh, and uh, the most important things that you want to include is make sure you include the SSH package. Uh, and um, you know, make sure that uh, you can you know just go all the way through and hit finish. And when you're done, you will have an icon like this on your desktop. You can drag it over here for quick launch, and double click on that, and now you're at the Sigwin command line. Uh, and you can just test out that it works by doing ping of google.com. And when we say launch Sigwin, that's what we mean. So now you've got a command line in Windows, and you can SSH from it.